Joshua Hing's reflective journal week starting the 19th of January 2021. So in our first week of online learning, we started diving into and researching our project for our spring commission, which is Bob Fosse and the musical Chicago. My first initial thoughts when I found out about we were going to be doing this sort of style and this sort of musical was I was absolutely excited because Chicago happens to be one happens to be my favourite musical, as well as I really do consider myself a Fosse dancer. I feel like that's the style of dance that really, really speaks to me as a dancer and a performer. And the, the lead character, Velma Kelly, is one of my dream roles. So when I found out that I could have had a chance to be, in, be part of this musical and take part in this sort of style, I was very, very excited and knew it was something I could do well. When looking at what we were doing online, um, one of the very like low points and something that re didn't really work for me personally was the fact that it was online learning. Learning choreography over a call is very, very difficult for me, not only because we are in our homes and not a dance studio, so the space is very, very limited. We don't have a lot of room to move about and to really show our full potentials as dancers. Uh, also, when we are learning the choreography of a small device and we have to move away from the small device in order to move around and dance to our full to sort of our full potential, it's really hard to focus on the dance and also look at what our choreographer is doing on the other side of the call. So to me, that was not really a strong point. But the highlights of these lessons were definitely my enthusiasm for the dance because I knew it's something I could do well and I know the style is something that I love. So I kind of already came into the subject with kind of a natural excitement and enthusiasm because it is something I can do well. Following on from our Fosse dance, we were also learning a tap number to go to with our Fosse dance from Fosse the Musical. And I believe it's also from the musical dancing. To me, this was also another not a very strong point because I have tap danced in the past and I do consider myself a reasonable, talented tap dancer. But also learning it off call was also something that wasn't up to scratch for me. And also doing tap shoes on wooden floor in my home rather than a dance studio was very very difficult and it's very very hard to learn the counts and the timing and the sounds of the tap shoes from on call because you know wi-fi connections and stuff like that really kind of hold the call a little bit so it was very very difficult and also i haven't tapped in a while and to kind of pick up my skills over call was something that was not good either but one of my high points was nothing to do with my dancing. It was more on my singing lessons because we are doing the music. We are learning solos from the musical Cabaret as well as doing um, Chicago as they are both Fosse musicals. This was a really good high point for me because singing is my life. It is definitely, as well as dancing, singing is also a passion of mine. And the opportunity to sing something from another one of my favourite musicals and to know that I can do it well was really a high point for me as well. And the feedback I got from my singing teacher was very, very nice to hear. So my action plan for the coming weeks is to kind of get used to using the space, asking my tutor for videos of the choreography so I can learn it away from the call so I know what I'm doing when we come to the call, and also to carry on working on my solos and really, really dive into the research of the musical and the style of dance so I'm really, really prepared for our project in March.